Welcome to the final installment of our five-part video series on seller performance. Throughout this series, we've been equipping you with the knowledge and strategies to set you up for successful selling on our platform. In this last video, we'll focus on how to proactively avoid buyer issues that contribute to your service metrics. First, we're going to look at reducing item not as described returns, which can significantly impact buyer satisfaction. Creating accurate and complete listings is essential in building buyer confidence and reducing item not as described returns. When creating new listings, include all relevant information about the item and add plenty of high quality photos. Take the time to also write out detailed descriptions, ensuring that you mention any flaws or imperfections. This makes sure that the buyer knows exactly what they're getting when they buy from you. For older listings that are good till cancelled, ask yourself, when was the last time you reviewed your item descriptions? Are there additional item specifics you could add? Do the photos need updating? Once an item has been sold, ensure it is packaged well to prevent any damage during transit. We also recommend exploring our tips on packing your sold items for guidance in this area. Improving your listings goes beyond reducing returns. It can increase listing visibility. Listing quality plays a role in determining your placement in eBay search. Including all relevant item specifics on your listings helps potential buyers find your items more easily. It can also improve conversion rates. More engaging and detailed listings can encourage more people to make a purchase once they click on your item, leading to higher conversion rates. And finally, it minimizes buyer inquiries. By providing detailed information up front, you can significantly reduce the number of questions you receive from buyers, saving you time and effort. Now, let's focus on how to reduce item not received requests. Online shoppers value quick and reliable delivery, so it's crucial to set accurate expectations for your buyers and fulfill orders accordingly. To ensure you're sending orders on time, consider the following tips. First, review your handling time. Ensure that your specified handling time is realistic and allows you to pack and send orders within the designated timeframe. You might also consider applying different handling times to different types of inventory or adjusting them during busy seasons or popular promotions. If you offer same day handling, make sure to set your cutoff times via shipping preferences in account settings. Second, assess your postage and shipping options. Prioritising cost, delivery speed and practicality when selecting a carrier. Tailoring services to different inventory types can also be beneficial to creating great experiences for your shoppers. And finally, ensure your listings match your delivery service. Send orders using the carrier and service indicated in your listing. We use the data to provide the buyer an accurate delivery time at checkout. If you offer multiple options for some items, for example, standard and express, ensure you use the service chosen by the buyer at checkout. By implementing these strategies, you'll be able to create a smoother buying experience for your customers and save yourself time so you can focus on running your business. We hope this series has been informative and helped you better understand our policies and how we measure seller performance on eBay. If you want to learn more, visit the Help Hub to explore all our articles about seller standards and performance. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell icon so you never miss a video from us.